impossible for any individual, whether private or government or official in this country, to influence the People's Republic of China to appoint CEE as the contractor for the project. Remember, in the Republic of China, we are willing to finance this project, provided DTE and private contractor. That's it. So people who say that uh, the first gentleman influenced anyone to do this does not understand the process. Nung sinabi niya ito sa Senado, biglang, nung pinahil na itong kaso, biglang may nagsulat na ng mystery man sa 7.30 a.m. If you look at the, may sinihingit, but if you look at it, walang mention dyan kay FG, walang mention dyan ang BACO. Tinulat lang yung mystery man, a term that uh, Mr. Javinesha used at the Senate subsequent to his uh, original politiko nila eh. Now obviously, sinabi ni Joey Javinesha, the mystery man was the uh, first gentleman, Mike Arroyo, and then they went to their notes and they said, ah, dito natin pwede ilagay si FG sa meeting. Anong implication kaya ni Tony? Perjury and subordination of perjury as a criminal offense. At ano ang senador ang mga kapahan ni Tito? Ha? Sa kapahan niya. Senador? Hindi ko alam. Hindi ko alam. Wala ko sinasabi kung sino gumawa. Sa kapahan ni Tito? No, no, no. I'm asking the ombudsman to investigate kung sino gumawa ng notes na yan. I have no assumptions kung sino gumawa niya. Then kung sino mas rin ang kakasukan ng perjury? Yeah. Yeah. Dapat. Understand na ang claim dito is that the uh, first gentleman has no participation based on their own uh, exhibits and based on the statements of uh, Joey De Venenza.